so good morning everyone from mumbai and a very warm welcome to each one of you to this session of sound healing and let us carry on from where we had stopped we were in the process of connecting with our ancestors inviting them lovingly lovingly to the healing session and making this as our service to them so just take a few moments and go within connect to the heart heart is the hub from there connect with the ancestral world invite all your ancestors from all lifetimes to come and be with you just feel their presence energetically around you and now make one more addition in our lives we all have had elders or teachers who have helped us who have guided us who have showered unconditional love upon us and because they have had a role to play in our lives in our evolution they are our ancestors so mentally think of all such people and request them to be here at the soul level and you can simply make this intention let my teachers and guides and loving elders from all lifetimes be here so even those souls whom you do not remember at this point because their memory is embedded in the subconscious mind they will also listen and come take your time to feel the presence of all these ancestors they have had a role to play in your evolution through various lifetimes offer them your very best you may not have been born in their lineage but there is a concept of the manas putra a child of the mind you are a child of the intellect of all these teachers and in that sense they are your parents just connect with them offer them your love and respect and humbly invite them to be here through this session of sound healing sometimes through our ways we create challenges for our elders 
so if you have created any challenge or if at some point they have been harsh or strict just resolve all those issues by listening to the frequency of forgiveness Seeking forgiveness and offering forgiveness unconditionally is the best way to resolve relationships. And as you do this with the ancestors, you can also do the same thing with those people with whom you are facing challenges here in this life. We all have friends. family members and relatives who are going through a tough time in their lives at this moment it is time that you can invite them at the soul level and offer them this frequency of forgiveness so that they can develop perspective on whatever they are going through then it becomes easier for them to negotiate through whatever challenges are cropping up happy relationship of past lives they manifest in our life in this current life as good happy relationships that help us that sustain us that give us love and challenges our difficult relationships from past lives they come and manifest as our challenges in this life in that sense whatever we have has been asked for and it is time to take responsibility and resolve everything in unconditional love but unconditional love can be felt only if we practice forgiveness and when we practice forgiveness we stop seeing the world as black or white everything is a shade of gray and we must develop the insight to see our role in it
And now all the souls that you have connected with, the souls of the ancestors, the souls of other people with whom you wanted to do forgiveness, the souls of your friends and family who are going through a tough time right now, invite all the souls to be present and receive healing in this session of sound healing. So let us do the chakra healing for a little while. We will move from the muladhar, the base chakra, to the crown chakra. So these frequencies will be played one after the other and as the sound changes, you can shift your awareness from the lower chakra to the higher chakra. So let's begin.
many a time souls are caught in this dilemma that they want to give up something which they know is not good for them and they are unable to give up so here is the frequency that creates a kind of break from the past Let all souls present here in this session. Be able to make a break from the past that is not desirable. And it is only when we make a break from the past, we can move on the path of liberation. So here is the frequency which creates a sense of liberation. And here is the frequency of 639 Hertz. It improves the communication between the four quadrants of the brain. We are able to see things clearly and we can build on this new understanding to resolve relationships so make this intention that this frequency works on all the souls who are assembled here It is time to work with more frequencies that activate the brain and the thinking process and eventually take us beyond the mind.
take your time to once again connect with all the souls you have invited. Wish them well. Take leave of them. And request them to return to wherever they came from. Do not forget to thank them for their presence. The biggest service we can offer to the universe is by improving our soul standing. When the soul standing rises, all the other souls in this universe are being served. So just be with yourself for a while. Let your awareness run up and down the spine so that the energy gets distributed You can follow this frequency of Om as you survey the spine And as the sound fades, become aware of whatever has happened in your physical body, 
or at the level of consciousness in your mind. If you are feeling very peaceful and centered, be alert and be ready to carry this peace and centeredness with you and let it be applied to every thought every word and every action of yours. When we operate from a space of peace and quiet, there is greater awareness to whatever we do and no karma is created. Become more aware of your breath. Become more aware of the movement in the chest and the abdomen as the breath comes in and as it moves out. Become aware of the contact between your sit bones and the chair or the bed on which you may be seated. And when you are ready, you can gently open your eyes and bring yourself in the present moment. So thank you everyone for being here. We will meet again tomorrow at the same time. We will end with Shanti part. Jacqueline had asked this question about having peace in the heart. Shanti part is our way by which we offer this peace in the heart that we feel at this moment to the whole universe. We say, O Sarvesham Swasti Bhavatu, may that be good to everyone. Sarvesham Shantir Bhavatu, may everybody experience peace. Sarvesham Puranam Bhavatu, may everyone feel complete. Sarvesham Mangalam Bhavatu, May what is auspicious happen for everyone. So it is our way of offering this energy to the whole universe for the well-being of everyone. So when we make such an offering, we don't make distinctions between one and the other. We just offer it to everyone. So we will just do the Shanti part. Om Sarvesham Swastir Bhavatu Sarvesham Shantir Bhavatu Sarvesham Puranam Bhavatu Sarvesham Mangalam Bhavatu Om Sarve 
ಭವಂತು ಸುಖಿನೇ ಸಂತು ನಿರಾಮಯ ಭದ್ರಿ ಪಶ್ಯಂತ ಕಶ್ಚಿದ ಶಾಂತಿ 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 ಸದ್ಗುರುನ Thank you once again. And see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.